More breaking news this time out of spring. That is where overnight two people died when a Tesla crashed into a tree. And it's what appeared to have happened just before the crash that makes it especially unusual. KPRC 2's Devin Clark's live in the Carlton Woods subdivision in spring with what happened. Devin? Jacob and Sophia, that Tesla that investigators say burst into flames has been removed to, from the scene, but you can still see tire marks here in the grass leading up to that tree where the Model S made contact. Two men inside the vehicle were killed, and we understand that neither of them were in the driver's seat. We're told that one was in the front passenger side and the other was in the rear passenger side when the vehicle failed to adhere to a curve and went into the woods. Because of the car's batteries reigniting the fire, the firefighters say that they had to use 23,000 gallons of water to put the fire out. This happened just after 9 o'clock last night, but investigators say they spent four hours extinguishing the fire. The two men who were inside of the vehicle have not been identified. And even though we know that neither of the men were in the driver's seat, investigators are still trying to determine exactly what caused the crash. As soon as we get more details, we'll bring them to you. For now, reporting live in the Woodlands, Devin Clark, KPRC 2 News. Thank you for the latest there. New this morning.